So what do leaders in Europe, how do leaders in Europe and the Middle East now view um, a Trump administration that is now three weeks, three and a half weeks on? Uh, well, they're a little bit confused because the whole tenor of the Trump campaign was to try and build friendly relations with Russia. Uh, and when General Flynn tries to build friendly relations, suddenly he's gone. Not for that reason, but for not obviously sharing what he was doing. So I think on that, I think on the big message that perhaps the embassy would get moved from Tel Aviv to Jerusalem, and now we're not sure. I think that what world leaders are doing on some of these issues is watching, waiting, and seeing. We're not exactly sure what Trump is going to do on these big issues. What we do know, though, is that his instincts are fiercely pro-Israel. And, and, and ultimately, uh, whatever tough decisions uh, this presidency has to take, it will take them in favor of Israel maintaining its independence as a state. Because don't forget, there are countries in that region that literally want to obliterate Israel, and Trump will be on their side.